YouTube, what is good? Welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video, I wanted to just give y'all some motivation. I wanted to explain to y'all why you're so unmotivated. And this is an important topic to me because I know once upon a time in my life, I was at the point where I didn't have motivation to wake up. I didn't even want to wake up. Because I thought, you know, life had passed me by. I thought to myself, no one loves me. I thought to myself, no girls take me serious. I thought to myself, I don't have a good circle of friends. And, you know, I finally took the red pill. What's the red pill? The red pill is the truth. To those of you who have seen the movie The Matrix, you know what I'm talking about. To those of you who have not I strongly, strongly recommend for you to watch that movie because you'll understand exactly what I'm talking about when it comes to red pill and blue pill. But the red pill is the truth. And I took that pill. Because a blue pill man is born every single day. When you take the red pill, you have such a distinct advantage over the rest of the field. I promise you that. Because you will finally understand the world for what it is. You will understand female nature for what it is. You will understand money for what it is. You will understand society for what it is. You will understand government for what it is. You will understand everything about this world when you take the red pill. And that's why I strongly urge y'all to take it. Now, why are you so unmotivated? There's plenty of reasons, and I'm going to break it down for y'all. You know what the first reason is? You beat your meat every day. Sometimes y'all do it multiple times in one day. You have any idea what porn does to your brain? You have any idea what unleashing your seeds of porn does to your brain? Obviously not. But it damages you big time. And I'm going to tell y'all right now, I stopped watching porn and stopped beating my meat to porn about five months ago. And it is one of the best decisions I ever made in my life. Because I'm going to tell y'all right now, when you go through that 30-day detox, and you will see how much more motivated you are for the day. You will see how much more confident you are in yourself. You will see how much less anxiety you have. All these things happen when you stop watching porn. It's, it's the truth. I wouldn't be saying this if it wasn't the truth. I wouldn't be sitting here making YouTube videos like this if it wasn't the truth. You sitting here busting on yourself, on your lap, on your hand, on your chest, on your chin. Are you serious? What's wrong with you? You ever get that feeling after you're done busting a nut? You just think to yourself, why did I just do that? That's because your brain's telling you, what the hell? I really just did that. So y'all just wasting time and energy on beating your meats. Beating your meats. Beating your meat. Stop doing that. I'm telling y'all, go 30 days without doing it. And see how, how much your life changes. It'll be a complete 180. Another reason why you're unmotivated. You hang around the wrong group of people. I'm going to tell y'all right now. Who you hang around with is so important, bro. Who you hang around with is super, super important. Because if you hang around the wrong crowd... What are you going to do? You're going to take their tendencies. You're going to pick up on what they do. You hang around broke people, you will be broke. Simple as. You hang around people who are fat and lazy, you will become fat and lazy. You hang around people who don't... You ha That's why I I'm telling y'all, you have to hang around people who have the same ideals as you, who, who want to get better. When you hang around, I'm going to tell y'all this. When I hung around people who weren't motivated, who were who were broke, I was also broke and unmotivated. 
It matters, y'all. It does matter. That's why either you have two options. Either one, start accepting to be a lone wolf, like I am right now. I genuinely feel like a low, lone wolf. And that's fine. All I need is myself. Or two, you get yourself a group of friends who are trying to get to this money, trying to get to this gym grind, and trying to better the quality of their life. And when you do that, watch how much better your life will be. Watch how much more motivated you will be. Another reason why you're unmotivated, you more worried about women than you are yourself. You over here concerned about how you're going to get with a woman and you don't even have a job. You don't have a car. You don't have a place to stay and live. And you concerned about a woman, bro? Really? That's why I made that video, my first video. That's why I said women doing you wrong should motivate you. And it should. A woman cheats on you. A woman breaks up with you. A woman feels like you're not good enough to be with her. So what? What you gonna do, cry? You gonna sit there and cry? Come on now. That should be the ultimate motivation for you. She don't want you, so be it, bro. Get yourself better. Go to the gym. Put in more hours at your job. Become a high value man. Do things that will improve the quality of your life. Why are you concerned about a woman and you don't even got any, you don't got a place, you don't got a job, you don't got a car. Why are you concerned about women? And even if you have a car, you still need a place. You got a place. Okay. You still need a job. All these, you got to get to this money. You got to get to this gym grind. You got to do these things. Going, look, bro, I'm going to tell you this right now. Going to the gym, just go three times a week. That's it. You don't have to go six times like I do. I go six times out of the week. But that's because I'm trying to get my physique right. But you don't got to go six times. Just go three. Watch how much more motivated you'll be for the rest of the day. Watch how much more energy you have, how much happier you are. It's real. Telling y'all. Stop putting your heart and soul into a woman. You're not even putting your heart and soul into yourself and into your dreams and goals. Watch how much better your life will be when you start focusing on yourself and who you want to become. Another reason why you're unmotivated? All you do is smoke weed and drink. What do you think that's going to do to your brain? All you do is smoke weed and drink every single day. You can't go one day without it. Just one day. And you wondering why you're so unmotivated. Come on now. You really need to smoke every single day, bro. You really need to drink every single day. I have no there is nothing wrong with smoking or drinking. But when you do it in excess, if that's the right term, if you do it too much. It affects you. You're just going to be worried about how you're going to lay back on the couch. Turn on your PlayStation. And just smoke away playing 2K and you're just getting fat. You're getting fat. Lazy. Put the blunt down. Put the bottle down for just a week. See how much better you'll be. Y'all have become dependent on those things to get through your day. That's not healthy. Not only for your physical health, but for your mental health too. But those are the reasons why you're unmotivated. And when you understand all these things and you stop sitting there and complaining about your life, you will get better. Instead of sitting there and complaining, start putting action into your life. Start applying the things that I'm saying into your life and watch how much better your life will be. I'm trying to help y'all, man. That's why I make these videos. I don't make these videos out of hatred for anybody. 
I don't make these videos. That's it. I don't make videos like this to be hateful towards anybody. I just want y'all to understand the world that we live in, the circumstances that we're in, and to help y'all get to the best version of yourselves. So with that being said, bruh, what's it going to be? You're going to continue to sit there and complain or are you going to get to this grind? You let me know. Peace.